Conjunctivitis basically is uh, an inflammation of the conjunctiva, which is the white part of our eyeball, uh, the superficial layer of the white part of our eyeball. And there can be many causes, such as an infective cause, and uh, also more commonly an allergic cause, uh, such as from you know, uh, exposure to certain uh, allergens, uh, for example, um, you know, dust mite or pollen and uh, things like that. If a person is colour blind, um, well, the most common form will be a red-green colour blindness. Uh, in such a case, uh, there will be difficulty in uh, the differentiating the red and green uh, hues. For example, um, a coloured map of the world that appears like this to a no normal person will appear more like uh, this picture here and this picture here to a red-green colour blind person and uh, yeah, this will be in a rarer form of colour blindness where the blue and yellow um, yeah, receptors are affected. Another example will be uh, in these two pictures. In this picture here will be what a normal person uh, can see, whereas in the other picture will be what a red-green colour blind person will see. A carrier mother can pass it on to 50% uh, of her sons. So in this picture, as you can see, a mother who has a gene of the colour blindness can pass it on to 50% of her uh, sons. So this one here is an unaffected son, whereas here is an affected son. Whereas her daughters will be carrier in 50% of the cases. In Singapore, um, our population has a prevalence uh, rate of red-green colour blindness of about 5% in uh, the males and in females, it's very low um, at about 0.2%. In a young adult, um, you know, we want to be uh, particularly concerned of um, well, acquired causes of uh, eye problems such as uh, contact lens related uh, problems because a lot of uh, young adults wear contact lenses. Um, and uh, of course, uh, you know, uh, avoidance of exposure to trauma, uh, sports injury, etc. In the uh, middle age group, such as the ones in their 40 to 50 years old, uh, presbyopia will be a concern, and um, that part of it, you know, we cannot avoid. And the only treatment is to wear um, well, presbyopia glasses. And um, in the elderly, those above the age of 60 years old, um, cataract and glaucoma will be the main worries. And uh, for these uh, age groups, uh, regular eye screening will be a good thing to do. And um, in particular, looking out for um, you know, problems such as glaucoma in which early treatment uh, is advisable. And uh, basically, for all age groups, having a healthy lifestyle, balanced diet, and especially um, in children, limiting uh, duration of close-up work uh, apply.